Hello, people and bots. Grandpa Kanak here, and we're in Stationers for another tutorial today. This is about making fuel. Yes, it's so annoying. Whoop! It's so annoying when you're working away, and all of a sudden you look and your welder doesn't weld anymore because its fuel container has gone dry. And you forgot that you needed to make fuel. Okay, so how do you make fuel? Well, fuel is, let's just put it up here and get the official description. A fuel canister, 64 liters mixed, 66% volatiles, 34% oxygen. That is key, 66 and 34. Now, the numbers do not have to be exact. You could be off by 0.1 or 0.2, and it will work fine in your um, in your welder. Okay, if you're going to sell it through the trader, you'll have a little bit of excess left over of one gas or the other, and that's how that will work. So that's the two main uses of fuel: selling it to traders and using it yourself, of course. So, how do you make it? Well, down here is my filtration system on my Mars base. Let's hop on down. Everything's color-coded here. So, red is my volatiles. So, all this is my filtration and storage and manipulation of volatiles. And white is oxygen. Filtration, everything's here, including taking oxygen off of my hydroponics. But, that's another story. For another day. So make sure you have enough to fill a canister. Here uh, we have over a thousand. That's good. And we have over 300. That's good. Now you need to bring these two gases together. It doesn't matter what your system looks like for the volatiles as long as you have a storage container of volatiles. You could be a canister, it could be a room, right? It could be a room, it could be piping, it could be anything, okay? But it comes together with the oxygen here. There's two input locations, input one and input two, okay? The knob is the gas mixer. Here you can see I have it set slightly off. So let's just alter that. There we go, 66 and 34. Okay, that's what you're aiming for. But if the gas is a different temperature, 22.3, 17.6. The resulting gas won't be the same. This gas mixer is taking in volume. The volume does not take into account the temperature. And when the temperature evens out between the two gases, it may, it may not stay at 66 and 34. So you may need to tweak your gas mix percentage one point the other way. Okay, so here I use orange, of course, for my fuel. I don't have a pressure regulator on here. I could make this a little bit more uh, fancy and safe. Uh, right now, if I, you know, go above 10, I will have a problem with this canister, etc. I don't intend to do that. I only have 1.17 in it. And you can see I also have an impurity of 0.003% of CO2. And this works fine. Okay? 
let's just, here is my canister that I'm using just to show you. See, it's got 0 0.004. I had a little oops with some oxygen in that line at some point in time, and rather than lose it all, I decided to deal with it and live with it. <laughs> so, here you can see, and it works. Okay, so once again, here's my tank. And it is 66 and 34 with 0 0.004 in error. Put that away. So let's run this. Here you can see it increasing. Look at that, 66.2. Oh no, we've got too many volatiles. What will we do? Well, let's cut it down by a percentage point. Look at that, it's back at 66. So you can manually play with it, and in this particular case, that is exclusively because of the temperature difference of 22.1 and 17.6 of my two ingredients. So easy problem to overcome. The end result, as you can see, is 19 degrees, which is between 22 and 17.7 now. Okay, and that's how you make fuel. Simple, straightforward. There's a lot more complex things in stationaires, and if you need a tutorial for it, uh, leave me a message. I will gladly answer the feedback. And if you have any questions about the fuel, manufacturing here um, you know you can uh, run your filtering system any way you want you can make it as complex or simple uh, in the beginning my first one had a uh, canister with a tank fill for oxygen a canister with a tank fill for volatiles and they just sat up at an angle like this one did and I mixed it. I didn't have anything elaborate uh, for a filtration system yet. But I was, as they say, a silly billy or a dumb dumb grandpa. <laughs> and I ran out of fuel. So I had to create a, uh, a system as soon as I could. And this is what I had forgotten to do. So that's it, everybody. Thank you very much for watching. If you uh, like this uh, tutorial, let me know. Let me know what else you need. So until next time, all you people and bots out there, be good to one another. Take care. Bye-bye.